It's already set up for KGS. How convenient. Very good. Alright. Hello, have fun. He decided to play a 3 4. Alright. We shall take 3 4 4. Approach. Okay. I'm going to approach his 3 4. It's fine. Then I'll press. This is the strategy of Lalila. Always approach first and then press. And then come back and do one of these. Because you're fine here losing that one sentai in the corner. Oh, and he's going to take that, which is okay for us. And then we'll just take this one. Really strong mid group here. So we can build off of this later. I think the, the last big move is probably here, right? Approaching this last corner. That's not developed. Okay, so since he wants that, I think uh, I'm going to take the corner. Give him that sign then. Since he wants to pence. See what he does here. He's kind of, Whatever he does, he's kind of over concentrated. If I jump, I'm going to lose Sentai. It's okay. Sentai is not too big of a deal right now for me. Okay, he pressed there. I'm not going to respond to that. I'm going to press here first. This group is very light. Treat this very light. That's his whole strategy. And then get ahead everywhere else on the board. Here, I think we can just... Maybe slide in the corner. I don't know. He seems to be really adamant about this. That group. We could attach. I think I'm going to slide in the corner. Slide in the corner and make ice. He didn't care about the corner. I think it's mine in there. Yeah. He protects that. And then I'm going to protect this side. Make sure he doesn't come from this side. So he has to come from there. And then I think I'm just going to block this like that. Uh, okay. He's trying to reduce our area. Which is okay. But he weakened the stone when he does that. Oh! Never seen that before, okay. If he... How many I'm gonna cut? Hmm. He's just gonna give those up, okay. I'll take that on the outside. Now this is in danger, and he needs to protect that. I'm gonna play this one to force him to defend, and that kind of defends my shape a little bit. And then I'm gonna attack this stone, I think. <clears throat> I'm okay here. Okay, that's not Sentai. So I'm gonna play somewhere else. I think I'm gonna play here to complete my shape. And uh, be alive. <laughs> it's a good thing when you're ahead to be alive. Uh, okay. Should I pull up on this side? Yeah, I think so. I don't know what he's trying to develop here. Ah, I see. He's trying to build this. Which is kind of strange. Hmm. I think I'll do this to stay alive. And then get Sentai back. So here I have Sentai back, right? I can do whatever I want with my Sentai. I think I'm going to do this one. To come in a little bit. Now I think... Hmm. Maybe this jump should be sufficient. Nah, I'm gonna come in this way first. It is Senta if he wants to build this. So, either he needs to block or do something. He's not going to, okay? That's fine. 
think I can start attacking this a little bit. Just come in some more. Right here. This block is pretty big now. Uh, I don't know, I guess. I'm trying to be fancy. I think here and then double on A. Okay. I'm just going to protect this stone. He's gonna have to deal with this cutting stones. I don't care that much for him. That's better to remove some of the uh, liberties. Whatever he does, this move is gonna be sente for me. Push up here. I don't want to get cut off. That's the only thing. It's gonna be hard for him to find liberties, though. Then I can just do that. I think I need liberty space. Yeah, I just need liberties at this point. If I play here, he's gonna. Nah, he. That doesn't work. He can't play here, because then I'll play here. Here. Right? So he can't do that. And this stone is not in a ladder. So I can play here. Yeah, I'll just... Do this one. Push through. Now I need to do that one. Then the best he can do is connection, which gives him three five, and then I can get five. Cause here and then into here, if he blocks Ayatari, he can't connect. So this game is pretty much over, and it is. He resigned. So let's see where he went wrong here. Review this game. Start seems okay. This seems okay. Uh, position why I don't like this for white's strong position. Um, this is really strong for white. White is very flexible here. And this space is really strong so this development is not guaranteed, but pretty close. And then this, if he doesn't play this one, has a really nice counter here later on. If this stone wasn't here, because once you play this, you can play the slide underneath. Like, if you play somewhere else, you have this to poke out his eye space later. So I don't like that combination for him. Then here, we're just happily taking the corner, which is okay, he's not doing anything. I think here is where he probably made a mistake. I think maybe approach here, or uh, I guess this top side is too loose. Or even, 
might be be the top side too. Right? This area is not so interesting that much. So that doesn't really do much. This these stones are very flexible and light and has pretty decent shape already. See so like that one again, not great. Like he's shown his intention too much. Like he's obviously trying to attack this, right? But this is not really attackable because then why can just slide in the corner or something like that? And then like that hollows out his points in the corner. So after that it's really hard to attack. This defensive move is uh, needed, but not necessarily the greatest move on the board. Because if he didn't do that, he'll just lose the stone. I think he should have played tier. The best white can do is uh, here, like that. And even then, you know, losing three stones is not a big of a deal. It's go take for white for six points. Um, here you protect, you're super strong, but you're also very over concentrated now as white I used to make this mistake too here I would play like this right try to be greedy and develop this but this is way too greedy um, and then black will be able to come in and reduce this area so this area is actually larger than what you're trying to develop over here right so black's not gonna give it all to you so it's better to play this one and block him from coming in here because now you have a strong group here and you're pretty strong here, so he can only come from the side. It's a it's a less more less greedy move, uh, better in the result. And then here, that's a really weird move. Usually, I see this as a follow up, something like this. This is a lot better than what he played. I think that's pretty weird because I can just push through and then I cut right. We're not going to protect like he, th he thought we would. We're going to counter. And then here, this is kind of giving white a little bit too much. Now this stone is very weak. He's not quite alive yet. This group is really strong, so white doesn't even have to worry. If he plays something like that, white would just give it up and make eye shape and pretty alive. So white doesn't really care about that part. That's why I don't like this exchange because white is super strong. Okay, and then here if you look at board analysis, um, white has one corner, two corners, black has one corner, a side, and that's pretty much about it. This not point yet because white is so strong here it can be reduced. And then so here position Y after white attacks something like this, white is ahead. Uh, I don't think there was Comey. And then plus there's forcing moves like these where you gotta block. And I didn't get the chance to play but this is also a good move here too. So the best he can do is like these kind of combination. Um, yeah I think white would just give those up and play something like that. And then white still has a really nice side here. And this group is still not lying. Right? So not the greatest attack. And then, yeah, so after that, white just took this point here. That's not Sente. Um, so white just took this point and make this group alive. I think black had, the last chance black had was probably attacking this group. But you would have to start like somewhere here. And then white would just come in the corner and then it's alive already. So it's, I guess it's not easy to attack that. Play here or here. Pretty much. Yeah, and then here white gains about 8 points here too, and then he gained about 9 here, but nah, not so much all points yet. And so if you look at the board, um, position-wise, yeah, black is still going to have to make up some more points somewhere. Endgame is all really just white's potential. I mean, black could have something in the middle, but after white play that, he doesn't block, it's kind of... So this is just like 9 points. And it's not even, it's not Sente 9 points, because I play that, he has to block. Right? And then I play this, he is Sente, so he has to play that. So really, it's just 4, 7 points. There. So white blocks. 
Then he plays a semi decent Tsuji, but I think a more straightforward would be right here. And just do that, right? But uh, he want he elected for go that for that one. So you don't want to do that because you get tricked. Because then it'll be that and that and that and then you know you got tricked. So you you want to block from the inside as normal, and then when he pull back, you connect. So the block, make sure he can't slide into your area. The stand up, the honey. Really, he should play here. Uh, I don't think I can double Hane here in this case, so I will probably play this. And then I guess he can push. He gained a little bit here, but we gained a little bit too. But this cut was kind of not great because now I have that. Okay. Maybe he could play this. And then what does white do? White play that. He plays this. Yeah, kind of hard to catch this group actually. Right? I think he could have played that. This jump here. I might have played this though. But I don't think it works because of this. So here. Not that one. Uh, actually, this one. And then Atari, Atari, Atari. Disaster for white. So I think that, that would have been better. Atari was bad because now I get this extension for free. He has to defend. He probably should have defend here to remove the liberties, right? Usually it's best to defend like he did, but this case, you want to make this empty triangle because you want to reduce liberties as much as possible. So now if he plays something like this, you can still play something like this, right? And kind of chase him down a little bit. He can't really play here. He still needs to protect something. And then here you can just get out. Like so. Right? So. That's another mistake he made. And then now white has one extra liberties. Which turns out is very crucial. During the... Uh, Rigma row here. Because if I didn't have that liberty, he could Hane right now. Correct? And then Atari. If this wasn't here, if he played this earlier, then he would be ahead. But he didn't, and then he connect, but it's still too late. Uh, I'm going to show you this because he can't push all the way through. So he did that, we just do that, and he can't connect because that's a take. Alright. I think that was a good game, and then now we shall get into another one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom. Oh, we probably should fire up Panda too. Panda, Panda, Panda. Oh, we got a game on Panda right away, okay. We will play Panda and shut out the KGS for now.